How's it going, everybody? I'm IGP, and welcome back to some more Subnautica. I'm getting attacked by these bonefish sharks, and they've managed to kill themselves off. They, they, they followed me all the way here. I found this nice little city of floating underwater islands, which are really cool. Hopefully, they're all dying off. Look at those dead fuckers. Ugh, I think, I think they were actually eating each other, which is the reason why. There we go. Okay, well, I managed to ram one to death. <laughs> anyway, I, someone had mentioned to me... I can't remember who, and I apologize, but someone did recommend me, uh, following a certain direction to come to this nice little city of fucking underwater islands, and this is probably the best thing that I've seen so far. I'm totally gonna build my first base here. Uh, again, this is a new save. I just kind of was demonstrating everything before. Uh, so right now I'm going to go ahead and spawn myself a, uh, Cyclops that I can keep around this area. All the sharks are dead. We got a we got a nice light setup too. Like we don't have to worry about lights. Uh, although the base does create its own light. Uh, everything is bioluminescent down here and there's quartz for days. Not that I need it, but damn. Okay, so we're at a pretty low depth though. So I'm probably going to need a good uh, module here in the Cyclops, the Pro Boater. Pro Boater because otherwise it's going to take damage. We got Gary Fish down here. Okay, so I don't know what I want to do about docking the sea, uh, the Cyclops, or the Pro Boater. Pro Boater, I think this, actually, I was looking at this. This is kind of cool if I could level this out. Like, I'm thinking like an underwater, nothing like a mechanical, nothing too mechanical, an underwater dock that can come up as like a pool here. Like, I can build like a little pool here and, ah, oh, shit. Oh, I need it to be day. Thank you. It's too dark at night, I'm sorry. I'm trying to build here. I, man, you know what? You guys are so annoying right now. So I can pretty much kill him with my sea moth. Oh, this is so annoying. Are we all dead now? Are we all happy and dead? You fucking open mouth fuck. Look at you. You're disgusting. That's why you're dead. No one likes you. Okay. So, the best way I feel to do this is to use this little nice little thing here uh, called the terraformer. <laughs> but uh, instead of digging everything out, I can go in here and basically dig out... Uh, using this little cheat called dig. <laughs> so it's gonna be dig 20. Uh, right? And then bam, it creates this hole. Alright, so this is gonna be the giant. I think it's a little too big, honestly. In fact, I might have to close this up and try again somewhere else. But this looks pretty cool, I guess. This is a nice little open dock. I should have done 10. Because it's a 10 um, radius, so technically it's 20 diameter. That should be able to fit a Cyclops in there. Okay, I guess I'm just not going to do that. I'm going to uh, relocate. Uh, probably down to more towards um, the islands over here. There's got to be a nice little area I can dock in. Well, it's got to be it's got to be in a safe depth, <laughs> apparently. So we'll do on the side right here, right? That's too low. Aha, here's one. No, that's too high up. Here we go. This one's nice. What happened to the game audio? It just went dead silent for some reason. That's creepy. That's creepy. I don't I don't like it. Okay, let's do uh, the dig thing. Well, we're going to do 10. So if we're sitting here safely at 140, we can do 130 like this. I'll lower it down a little bit. Okay. Dig 10. Bam. Right? Okay, and then I can pretty much just go straight back southwest, straight back. Okay, uh, and then do dig ten, straight back, dig ten, straight back, up a little bit, up a little bit, uh, dig ten. Okay. So that's cool. It kind of worked. It was easier than, uh, you know, sitting here trying to... Actually, that looks pretty freaking sweet. As a matter of fact. That looks awesome. Okay, so I'm gonna try to do it again. Lower it. I'm gonna do it a little bit farther back. It's like a nice little indoor docking station. Uh, dig. Straight forward. Uh, lower a little bit. Um, dig. Straight forward, lower a little bit, and dig. That should be far enough. Hell yeah, this would be good. This would be awesome. This would be awesome! Yeah, let's do this! Look at that. That's like perfectly cylindrical. I can't even do that to Bethel myself if I was Arnold playing this game! Okay, so that's gonna be our little thing. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a, a beacon. A beacon! 
All right, and we're gonna place. What happened to the music? I don't know what happened to the music, but it's a little scary without it, you know. There we go. Uh, edit beacon label. We're gonna call this docking. Bam. So that's always gonna be there. So we know exactly where we need to be with the sea moth or the cyclops. Let's go ahead. Dock the sea moth. I meant cyclops. I keep getting those names confused all the time. Let's go ahead and dock this and bring this up in here. Again, I'm sorry about the frames dropping. It's not the most fully optimized game yet. I lowered down the uh, settings, but there's only so much that I really can do. Um, and it's always going to be a little bit glitchy. Now, I was going to set up a power station, but I'm not sure uh, if the power station when I, when I dock is going to actually charge this thing. Because there's no, like... There's no charging uh, display anymore, like percentage charged. The, the, I mean, the power cells are back there, but I can't really do anything with it, so I don't know. Let's do this. Let's bring this on up to what we had before, just a pro boater. Pro boater! Let's do a little bit of yellow this time. I think that's going to look pretty good. All right, so let's take a look at this here Seamoth, or Cyclops. Pro boater, pro boater! Damn, I keep messing that name up. Why do I keep doing that? I don't even know what... Let's drive on over here. So this is going to be... So, I guess if you guys are trying to name the city now, I'm doing this as the first um, actual episode where I'm building because um, I, I want to gather some more ideas of what we should do. I think this is going to be a perfect squeeze. Eh, at least I won't damage anything when I go to park. Oh, dude, this is beautiful. The best docking station ever. Look at this. It is like the perfect fit. Anyway, yeah, so if you guys are coming up with names, I suggest, um... Yeah, dude! That was a perfect height. 20. Just barely, though. That's pretty good. Okay, so that won't touch. That won't get crushed. That's good. But in, either, in any case, the only thing I'll ever do is damage the uh, Cyclops, which I can heal myself. So it needs to be, like, a little bit more, uh, because the tail is still sticking out. This is a long-ass boat. I didn't even realize... How big it was. Okay. <laughs> Giggity. Anyway, yeah, so if you guys are going to come up with some clever names for the, um, for it, I think it actually will fit all the way back here. If you guys are going to come up with some more clever names for it, it would be cool, um, to include the fact that the first part of the base is in a giant, uh, uh, you know, city of floating islands underwater. Yeah, I got to do this one more time. Let's bring the builder back here because we're going to start building in a minute. Uh, I basically want to do is put a charging station around here and then an exit part where I can, uh, like a, just a platform here and then I can just move on. Okay, so I need to be at 30, uh, depth, and then over here, and then we're gonna, wait, I gotta make sure I'm lined s s in the center. Okay, so the, the pro boater lights are right there, Let's raise up a little bit, facing that way. Uh-oh, something happened. Uh, wait, dig, 10, bam, okay, cool, I can put it in, it would be so awesome if we could create giant, like, a gate mechanism, but that's what they're doing, uh, the habitat update is not out, I didn't want to confuse anybody, the habitat update is not actually out, um, we just have access to the stuff that they were messing with in the experimental mode, uh, which is again what I'm playing right now, um, so when it comes out, they may have a lot more stuff. So this is awesome. We are here. It fits perfectly. This is our new docking station. And it looks pretty fucking sweet. In fact, I want to try to decorate the outside of it. But nonetheless, that is our docking station now. And we have it labeled, so we're good. Um, what I want to do is go ahead and dig straight up with the terraformer um, and exit. So actually, let's go ahead and put the first foundation piece down. Now, I've realized I can actually do the, um, what's going on with the music, man? Here we go, here we go, here's some fun stuff. Okay, so I know, let's go ahead and dig out, uh, about five, um, which would be fine. I'm totally fine with doing only five up here, halfway up, um, or up here, yeah, there we go. So we're gonna do dig five. So, and then we can actually, what well, actually what I want to do is try to... Um, go, yeah, like, dig three, dig two, there we go, and then that's fine. So, like, this is, like, a little tunneling entrance right there. Yeah, that looks awesome. That looks awesome. Okay, so what we're gonna do, 
is we're going to put our first foundation down underneath where we exit the thing. If I can put that evenly here, that would be pretty cool. Let's put it right, right there. That seems about right. I think that's pretty good. Oh, didn't mean to move it. But it worked. I think it worked. Yeah, so I can get, still get underneath. We're tilted a little bit, it seems like. We can still raise up, I guess. Yeah, that's gonna be fine. That's gonna be fine right there. I can always move it. No big deal. No big deal. We can move it. Okay, and then what I want to do is try to make it look interesting. So, let's put... Uh, mm, eh. Let's try... Okay, that's not going to work out so well. Now, for some reason, I wish you could center this. You know what I mean? Like, you can't actually center it. Maybe if I put a room in or a moon pool, maybe a moon pool would look cool. Um, actually, I just want to kind of decorate this in a bit. Like, right? Like, uh, that's pretty cool, right? Just put some out to the side, make it look interesting. Bam. Fast build is amazing, like as if it's part of a giant thing coming out of the ground. God, that looks so cool. Okay, uh, yeah, that's cool. The music stops out here. That sucks, but hey. All right, so I'm going to build a few more up here. This is all decoration, guys. I'm going to immediately try to make it look beautiful. Please don't hate me for it. All right, let's put one more up here on top. Like that. And like that. Now, we can reinforce this, I guess, uh, just to make sure that it doesn't, you know, die off. Now, I think as the bases are separated, they're, they have their own different integrity levels, I guess, and they'll breach only if the bases that are connected are damaged. So, these will kind of, um, actually, I can put this a little bit more back. Oh, that looks sweet. That looks super sweet. I don't want to see any edges. You know what I mean? Like, I want to see it go back as if it's part of the thing, okay? So, let's put that there. And then that there. Oh, this looks so amazing, guys. I'm so happy about this. Can I put it back there, though? Uh, okay, literally I can't because there's no room. Do I need to put one back here? Can I? No. Oh, wait, I could. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's as if this one's covered by rock. That looks so cool. I, I, I like it, guys. Let me know in the comments below if you like it, too. I think it's pretty awesome. All right, so this is what we're looking at when we come in. Um, essentially I can put a power source up here. If I really wanted to, I can put it right there. Didn't mean to hit the Cyclops. But I don't think it can come... Okay, maybe it didn't. But that looks interesting. <laughs> that looks pretty cool. Um, so now we can put, uh, I guess solar power... Solar power, it's fine. Oh, no, it's not going to get any sun. What am I talking about? All right, so we need, um... Oh, what do we need? We can't do that. Because it needs it needs sun power. Fuck. Well, that kind of sucks. What am I supposed to do then? We'll figure that out later. The, the, the It doesn't really need power right now, but it would look cool if it was up there. All right, so this is what we're looking at for an entrance. Uh, I want... I wish we could center this, but we can't. I mean, I could do it here. Ah, uh, no, I still can't. Still can't center it. Maybe a room can be centered. Kinda. 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 Nope, not really. Okay, so if I go back a little bit. Oh, here we go. So I'm gonna try to ang I'm trying to separate this into its own uh, base where it's not connected to. As a matter of fact, I probably need to get rid of this to do that. Let's try to get rid of the foundation. Huh? And then I can probably isolate this. There we go. Bam, like that. So that's going to be the entrance with a hatch. So it's a totally separate base. And what we could do is terraform. Uh, we have no material. I can grab some later. I'll grab some later. It's not really important right now. Um, yeah. So we can do this. What are we doing? Oh yeah, we can go in here and then build from there. And then what I want to do is kind of go in here I, I still want to have stuff, so I want to be able to... Let's do one more um, right here, and then let's try to add a room if we can. That would be most good. Okay, let's... 
Damn it, I didn't get to build it. Okay, so it's somewhere out here. Let's try to make a hatch. Oh, maybe if I can make a door here. I don't think I attached it right. <laughs> Bulkhead, yeah, I didn't attach it right. Let's make a hatch here real quick. Get out. Oh, I'm in the room. Okay, here we go. Here we go, it attached, it attached, kinda. It attached, kinda. What is this little thing doing here? So we're swimming. Not really sure why we're swimming here. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, am I, am I like stuck? Oh, there we go. So, okay, so I go in here. Inside. Not sure, can I terraform this? Yeah, there we go. Awesome. Okay, so it was a little glitchy at first, but I think it's working now. Yeah. It's working perfectly. Let's go ahead and save this. This looks so awesome. I love this. I love this right now. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and reinforce the base, uh, just in case. You know. Um, or we can put a window down and look at some rocks. Maybe that's fun. Okay. So this is what we're looking at here. This is part of the room. Um, okay. And then, what I could do is do a double-decker room, and I could just have, like, all my starting stuff here. Like, lockers everywhere, some aquarium for fish to keep in, and then uh, I can do a double-decker room. So let's reinforce the angles, or the corner ones, because you can't really do anything with those. And then we should be fine. Bam. Okay. Um, let's do... Let's do another room up top. Can I do that? No, I can attach it to the side, though. Don't know how I feel about that. There we go. Okay, room. Let me get rid of this. Awesome. So there's one room there. We'll put another room to the side, but let me go ahead and ensure the uh, integrity of it. Okay, so we got that. This is going to be our home base over here, though. Um, not any anything crazy. Okay, and then the room uh, over here. Bam. Alright, let's get rid of that. And then some more reinforcements. This is going to be a strong base. Um, and then what I'm, my plan is to take... Hopefully this works. Is to take the uh, vertical connector. I can't even do that. Okay, maybe if I put a ladder... Okay, I have to somehow get out of here. So let's make uh, one of these come out of here, like so, and then we can get rid of it, right? Or no. Or nah. And let's make a hatch. <laughs> let's try to dig. Uh, dig five. Okay, so we can get out. Now it's like a little safe area right here. That looks pretty cool. So what I want to do is try to put a vertical connector down, and I don't know if... Oh, dude, that's awesome. Right there. Right there. Okay, so what, oh, what else could we do? Um, I'm, I guess this is fine. I just kind of wanted it to be... Yeah, I guess that's fine. Actually, let's rebuild this guy, because he's not connecting to the ground, and that scares me a little bit. There we go. All right, now, if I put it here, I think it should actually connect to the... Yeah, that looks cool. Okay, cool. Just trying to make it look pretty, guys. Don't mind me. That's fine. And then we're going to go ahead and add our little tubes. And then little tube here. And then little tube here. Boom. And then little tube here. Boom. And then little tube here. Boom. And then little... So basically, this is going to be uh, a giant ladder. Uh, that's going to go travel up to the base up here, so I don't actually have to do any crazy climbing or anything. Um, or swimming. I mean, I could, but that would be boring. Come on, tube. Come on, tube. Come on. Let's get there. There we go. There we go. Okay. So now what I could do is put down a foundation somewhere around here. Can I lower it? Actually, let's, uh, let's put... Um, another room here. Can this attach to that? I don't think so. Wait, maybe. Uh, let's do this. Yeah. Let's just do a... I don't know what to do. I guess uh No. I guess a... Uh, I don't know. What should I do, guys? Uh... I guess the corridor's fine. 
So I'm just going to put that there, and then we can start the base from there. So now I think we can put the foundation underneath. Yeah, on basically this level. Uh, let's put a hatch right here real quick, and then we'll do the ladder, the ladder thingamajig. Uh, that is going to go straight down into hell. <laughs> it's literally going to go straight down into hell. Bam. Now we're all the way down at the bottom. We went from 128 depth to 85. Instantaneously. Amazing. Amazing stuff. And now we have our rooms. Uh, actually, yeah. There's a straight shot back here to go up. These two rooms will be our storage. Um, and that's going to be what we're looking at here. So let's let's take a look and see how this docking station is going to play out. As if we traveled from some crazy uh, board Cyclops. Yes. Probably have to make. I have to probably have to redo the undocking part because that's going to be. So if we want it, we can just back out. This is what we're looking at here. It looks pretty cool. This does look pretty neat, guys. This is a nice little docking station. We got our little label. So let's go ahead and pretend that we're coming from a deep sea dive. Away from whatever. Doing whatever. Here's the floater islands, which will connect all together eventually. Um, let's turn around here. All right, let's go down a little bit. All right, let's see what we got. Now, I need to add this module to here so this doesn't suffer from damage from being too deep, you know? All right, so here's the docking station. Boom, we're home, guys. We are home. We are home. Let's go ahead and straighten this out here because there's no side maneuvering here. It's literally like a car underwater. You know, you'd think they'd have that technology by now, but nope. Okay, so we're going to go over a little bit under... We need to be at about 125 meters. Damn, son! Hold on. <laughs> Do the alarm. <laughs> that was awesome. I didn't expect that. There are other leaks where? Where are the other <laughs> leaks? <laughs> the alarm started going off. It was so loud in my ear. I think that was it. Was that it? Was that all the leaks? I guess so. The turbine's not making any noise. I feel like uh, I glitched out the... Let's heal that up. Okay, and then where's the other one? Alright. Something is still hitting this. Something's attacking us right now. Alright, let's just straighten out. <laughs> it's not going to be perfect, you know. It's just like parking a car, pale parking, whatever. You're eventually going to, uh, you know, mess up. That's fine. Okay, so I'm going to try to align it that much... And then we can get out. So this is pretty cool. This is our docking station, guys. Well, I'm probably going to go ahead and cut it here. I hope you guys enjoyed joining me and building this thing. It was a lot of fun. I kind of wanted to expect, or inspect to see the fuck was attacking it. I guess it was just hitting it still. Ah, uh, the quiet city of floating islands. Anyway, yeah, so leave a comment in the comment section below letting me know what else I should build upon this. What should the top part of this base be? When I go in here... I know I'm going to have all my storage stuff. That's my decision here on the left and right. I'm going to label them eventually. But I'm going to go ahead and make this up here. And then we use this to escape into four different directions up top. Now we can do whatever we want with this. There's uh, a few pillars here. That's actually a kind of a neat place to end up. So we can make something out of this. Um, anyway, so yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you want to call the city as well. I need some more information on that. Anyway. If you guys enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Like, share, favorite, and subscribe if you haven't already. I love you all, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.